Yo, what is up guys, it's Gumwings here, back with another reaction video, as you guys can see I have a different setup this time, um, I finally got a noise casting headset, I mean headphones, um, I'm not actually using the mic for this, I tested the mic earlier, and it was kind of bad, I'm using my other headphones for the mic, so as you guys can see, see here, I have, my, I have my earbuds plugged in, so I have this mic working, it's actually better than like the other, the other headset I've been using, so I wouldn't use this, for my um, reaction videos. Tell me if you guys like this new change. If you guys don't, I'll go back to using this headset. I kind of didn't like the audio for this one. Like the, um, my mic thing for it. But it's good on PS4 for some reason. Anyways, we're going to be reacting to a new video by Suzy. It is a diary of a dog lover. I've been missing a few Suzy videos. I'm sorry that I'm not active mostly. I've been missing a lot of reaction videos lately. So I'm going to get back to my reaction videos, I'm going to go back to upload videos for you guys, and I hope you guys will enjoy this video. So we're going to react to a diary of a dog lover by Suzy, like I said before, if you guys want to watch the video for yourself, um, hit the, there's the link down below, make sure you subscribe to Suzy as well, so we can discuss on what we like about him. Anyways, let's get on the video in 3, 2, 1. I love cute little dogs. I don't know why. I just do. There's mm -hmm. one little problem though. Every dog that I've ever owned hates me. <laughs> you see the scar on the back of that one? She's so cute. I got it from one of my dogs. Wow. What I tell myself is that they all have deep-rooted psychological issues. And you know how you see people driving around and the dog is in the back seat with his head out the window looking all cute? Mm -hmm. I can't do that. Let me roll the window down for you, Cooper. He jumps out. Anytime wow. I was leaving the house or coming home from work, as soon as the door would crack open, pew! Oh. I would sit there wondering, like, what is their plan? What's your modus operandi? You just get away, you. and then what? Being homeless is a better option than living with me? Oh, wow. Right. And what do I do? What do I do to the dog? I don't know what I'm doing. It has to be me. If all of them don't know each other and they all hate me, I'm the common denominator. Yeah, you are. There is one thing I hate about dogs. When you have that neighbor that has that dog that they keep outside and oh. he never stops barking. Yeah, I know what you thought. I know what he's talking about. It's like when one dog barks, the whole neighborhood of dogs bark. Like it's only that one dog that starts barking and it causes a stir up. Like everyone's allowed for a couple of minutes until all finishes. Um thank thankfully like I don't have that much dogs in my neighborhood. There are a few like of my neighbor that are on the same street as me. That are on the same block to have a dog. But like they don't bark that much. Either that or because I don't hear it because my wind because I'm my window's always closed. So I barely hear any barking. <laughs> I heard there's a study that says dogs never get tired of barking or hearing the sound of their own bark. Wow. <laughs> How does your neighbor not hear that dog barking nonstop? The windows are closed. Have you ever had anybody give you a free dog? I'm nah. super sussed out every time that happens. My aunt was at work. Her coworker came up. Hey, do you want a free dog? His name is Benji. It's like Snoopy. He comes over to my no, that's Snoopy. Hey, Scooby. You guys want a free dog? He really looks like a. He really looks like a Scooby, but like worse. <laughs> Benji was psychotic. I wake up in the middle of the night. Benji sitting over me like. Oh. <laughs> So I'm thinking okay. me and Benji just got off on the wrong foot, right? The next day I go to pet him. Hey, Benji. He spites you. Hey, he the... gonna bite you. Oh! <laughs> I called it. <laughs> Who bit me? Who hurt you, Benji? Sure enough, about a month later, some random person off the street went to my dad and was like, Hey, you want a dog? Sure. What's the worst that could happen? So when my dad brought Kayla home, we had three dogs at that point. Key, wow. Kayla, and Benji. <laughs> so one day, I'm upstairs playing PlayStation, and I hear Kayla barking outside. Go down to the kitchen, look out the back window. The there's squirrel. There's a little chihuahua there. Oh. But she's not moving. She's just standing her ground like... Brrr. So the little chihuahua is standing in my backyard looking at Kayla. I see Kayla has some slack on that chain. I do quick maths, and I'm like, okay, that dog is 
far enough to where if Kayla charged the dog. No, we... it's not. It's not. He's gonna kill the, the chihuahua. Kayla's gonna destroy that chihuahua. If I forget the name right, the dog's name's Kayla, right? Good. She's not gonna reach the chihuahua. Kayla's there, foaming at the mouth now. <laughs> And the chihuahua starts inching closer. Wow. <laughs> what is you doing, bro? Is you trying to die? <laughs> I, so at this point, I go out the back door. I know Kayla's crazy. I'm not about to get close to Kayla because I don't want Kayla to confuse me. So then I try to get the chihuahua to leave. I'm like, get out of here. There's a whole lot of gang stuff going on over here. You don't want this problem. No. I promise. Out of nowhere, this lady comes around the corner. Oh, thank goodness. There you are. Come here, Bobby. Come here, Bobby. Come here, Bobby. Why would you leave your dog Bobby? And looks back at Kayla like he's weighing his options like, hmm. So then the dog takes another step closer. Good day for us. Well done. Now go. Oh. Oh my God. And then she jumps on top of Kayla. So now she's like fighting Kayla. So I grab the chain and then yank Kayla. Ma'am, ma'am, are you okay? Okay, what am I gonna call? You wanna call an ambulance or something? No, 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 it's okay, it's okay, it's fine, it's fine, it's okay, it's okay. And she leaves. I never saw her again. So the I tell my died. they start having the conversation. Do we get rid of the dog or nah? <laughs> so at that point, I put her in the laundry room. I go to work. So I'm usually the first person home each day from work. I look in the laundry room, Kayla is gone. She dug a hole. Okay, how do you dig a hole through a wall? Like that's not no a normal dog. That's like something else. To escape. And this is all happening three days after that whole Chihuahua incident. <laughs> I call my mom. Uh, mom, Kayla's gone. What do you mean? She Shawshanked her way out of there. Find that dog now. <laughs> We've got construction workers all over building new houses. We've got kids playing in yards. And this is the equivalent of Jurassic World where all the dinosaurs get out. My new hybrid dinosaur raptor is on the loose. <laughs> when I was in the theater watching it, I'm sitting there watching it like, same girl, same. I know I've been there. This has happened to me too. So I jump in my car and just start driving and I'm looking for this dog everywhere. And my mom is blowing up my phone. If that dog bites somebody, they're gonna sue us for everything and we're gonna lose everything. As my mom's talking to me, I'm on Zillow putting our house up for sales. Drove around the block like four times. Yo, when I tell you I don't know how I found this dog, I really don't. I got out of my car at one point, I just felt her presence, and I just yelled, Kayla! And I see this head peek up out of the <laughs> I just held my hand out like I had some wow. food. I'm like, come get it! So when she came over, she bites gotcha. you. Oh. Needless to say, by the end of the week, all dogs were gone. It was a clearance sale. My wow. dad was standing outside of PetSmart like, hey, you want a dog? Sure, what's the worst that could happen? It kills them. <laughs> Man, he really has some, some weird dogs. Now I'm wondering, like, what happens if I get a dog? Like, will that happen to me? Will, like, the dog love me or hate me? Uh, let's get on to the review. Wow, Susie really has some weird dogs. Like, bro, they're not normal. Like, you think the dog would, like, listen to him. Or at least obey his order. But no, they're not normal at all. But like, it's it's kind of funny. Imagine he had a dog right now that was like that, and he just recorded a video of his dog breaking through the wall. That would have been so funny. So I hope you guys like this reaction video. Uh, I'm starting to get back with the reaction video, so hopefully you guys did, did enjoy this. Um, you can watch the video for yourself. The link to down be the description down below. I can't talk. As well as I'm leave the link to Swoozy channel as well so make sure you go subscribe to Swoozy anyways guys um I'm, that's gonna be it for today I would rate this video um what did I rate it let's say um 9 out of 10 it was almost perfect it's just that like bro how does the dog escape and like the ending part but Hey, Susie's still like one of the best people I've reacted to, so hopefully just keep, still keeps it up. So yeah guys, that's it for today. Make sure you like the video, hit the subscribe button if you haven't yet, and hit the post notification bell so you don't have a schedule. Anyways, peace out. You better love it.